Welcome to another video with Linux Mint 19.3 and this time we'll talk about Wine version 5 which will allow you to natively execute and install Windows applications. Linux, oh yeah, all these uh, commands will be in the description of this video. So we will use uh, console commands. First, we are removing the old version of Wine, which is coming uh, pre-installed with uh, uh, Linux Mint. And has to install a few packages which are particular for Linux Mint 19. Actually, I believe all 19.x versions. And they are not suitable for Ubuntu and some other Linux distributions. So some of the packages include uh, support of 32-bit applications, some of them particular audio libraries and apps. And by the end of uh, not so long uh, installation process, you'll be able to execute uh, Windows, natively Windows applications. I'll give you an example of how to use on two of them. And uh, I will not use any third party helping you for installing uh, applications. You can uh, search in Google if you're interested about, but uh, I will just use just purely natively wine. First test is uh, one image graphical freeware program, Accent View. It's really nice uh, app, and uh, I'll use the installation. You can download uh, like uh, just a portable with zip, but um, just for the sake of it, to show you that you can just double click and execute. The very first time when you execute, Wine will need to download and install a few other uh, libraries. It will look that it will ask you the same window a few times, but actually it's installing a different apps underneath. So just keep clicking install until this process finished. And that's the very first time. After them, you're not gonna see that. And here it is the Windows uh, application setup starts normally, like what you experience in Windows nothing uh, different if the windows application creates a link it will be this white icon you will see on the left side and the one which is with a nice correct icon has been created actually by one so i will delete it and the very first time when i start application it will recreate it because uh, it's a uh, it's in the settings to when it starts to create a shortcut. So I will delete it second time and it will never appear again. But that's uh, just the Windows shortcut links are not correct. You can delete them and one creates the shortcut for you. Here it is, application working very correctly. In the menu, Every single app you'll find in category Wine. So if you install something through Wine, you'll find in category Wine. My second test is with uh, another freeware program, 7-Zip. This time, you see that it will straight goes to natively setup installation. The Wine doesn't require any more anything to launch for a store reconfigure itself okay click twice and the setup process starts right away I will remove uh, you'll be able to see it in the category wine as I mentioned here it is this is very simple. Thank you for watching.